Welcome to Day 8. Alright, so here we are. It's the morning of Day 8. Uh, before we get started, I just want to go over a couple things real quick. I uploaded Part 2 last night. And fire engines. But anyway, I uploaded Part 2 last night. And I uh, want to go over a couple of the comments that were in there. There's a couple people that were expressing concern that this is not going to last very long because I'm using uh, pallets to make it with and they decompose rather quickly. Uh, I just wanted to address that real quick. Um, if this thing lasts me two or three years, I'm completely fine with that. Uh, it's more about me building the project and doing something and then having something fun for a little while. So if this thing only lasts two years, three years, I'm, I'm totally cool with that. It's not a big deal. Um, the next thing, I'm sure you guys can tell that I'm getting a little, a little scruffy here. I've decided that I'm not going to trim my beard or shave or anything until this project is done. Uh, I'm doing that for two reasons. Uh, one reason is I hate seeing this, <laughs> so it keeps me motivated to get that finished. And another reason is it's going to give me uh, and you guys a visual representation on my face of how long this project took. So it's two things we're going to do there for that. So let's go ahead and get started on day eight. Uh, I'm still kind of tired from yesterday. My muscles right here hurt really bad. So I'm just going to try to get three pallets done today, I think, and get this third row done. And then we'll have the deck 60% complete. So that's really my goal today. It's only 9 a.m. It's getting really hot already. So, and I'm in pain. My back hurts. My muscles hurt. You know, I haven't done a whole lot of shoveling in a little while. But anyway, try to get this deck 60% today, and that's our goal. So let's go ahead and get to work. Back to the time lapse for you guys. Less time lapse is once the deck's done, I promise. All right. got two more done I only got two more done I'm really freaking tired my back hurts it's really hot you see how long the deck's gonna be I have those two just sitting there I'm just really freaking hot and tired so I'm gonna call it a day today I can't do any more today I need to rest for a full day so I'll see you guys tomorrow peace Alright, so we're about three, three and a half hours in for today. I got these four in and level. I still have to connect them down under there and on the sides here like I've been doing. If you can see it. You've seen it in the last video. 
Oh, the GoPro battery's about to die. So I'm gonna turn it off while I just put the two by fours in there to connect these four together. And then uh, we'll get started back again tomorrow. So as you can see, I'm hot and sweaty and dirty. So I'm gonna go rest for a few minutes, get a drink of water, come back out, tighten these up. And then we'll get the last four done tomorrow. We're at freaking 80% of this deck being done. So a little point of advice, if you ever have the opportunity to do this project by yourself, don't. Try to get some help. Uh, I don't really have any way to get any help, so I have to do it by myself, which is fine. I'm not complaining. It's just a lot of work. It takes a lot longer to get something done when you're by yourself. It's harder to stay motivated when you're by yourself. So if you can have a work partner, fucking get one. If not, man up and do it like I did, or I'm doing, I guess. But 80% of the foundation for the pool done get the last 20 percent done tomorrow then we'll get it sanded we'll get it painted then we start building the pool so fucking onwards and upwards so there we go 80 percent done not bad for a 40 year old out of shape fat guy if i say so myself so day nine that's a wrap for you guys i got about 30 more minutes of work to do but day nine that's right for you guys day 10 hopefully we'll have the foundation for the pool done see you tomorrow Well, it's day 10, the backyard project, but it's looking like it's gonna rain again. So I'm not sure we're gonna be able to get this finished. <laughs> it's been sitting here for two days, 80% complete. Took the day off yesterday uh, because it had rained the night before really bad and all this was mud out here. Did a bunch of work in the greenhouse, working on getting that video up for you guys. Uh, so tried to fit, come out here and get this finished this morning, but it's, I think it's gonna rain. What do you guys think? looks and feels rainy to me but I'm still gonna try to get a little bit of work done before the rain hits so we'll see we'll see if we can get anything done here so day 10 try to get this finished so we can start actually building the pool all right Yay! It's done! Yay! It's done! The deck is done! Well, 99.9% .9 done. I still have to put the tie together, tie these four together, and then to, you know, the tie together part. That's all I got left to do, though. This thing is done. Let's check it out. I'm super stoked. That was a lot, a lot of freaking work. It took 10 days of me doing this. Uh, so I'm really happy with how it looks. Got it all nice, got it all level, as level as you can get pallets. Uh, just rinsed it all off so it's nice and clean, so let's take a look at it. I'm really, really happy. So there we go. Look at that, you guys. 14 feet wide, 20 feet long. That's about as level as you're going to get with pallets right there, I do think. Let's give it a little walk around. Sorry if the video is a little shaky right now. I don't have the GoPro on the gimbal because the battery was dead. And I can't charge it while it's on the gimbal. 
Well, there we go. Look at that, you guys. I don't want to go walk on it right now because it's wet and my shoes are dirty. But freaking done deal. So I'm super stoked. I'm gonna call it a day. Beginning of the day, if you remember, I thought it was gonna rain this morning. Charger for the GoPro. Uh, did not rain, it did the exact opposite. Stayed cool for a little while, then it got really hot and muggy again. So, I'm tired, been close to four hours out here today. I'm gonna call this a wrap. The rest of the game plan will be tomorrow morning to finish getting these four trussed up and then start sanding this beast. Try to get it all sanded in one day, clean it off again, let it dry overnight. And then hopefully Monday morning or Sunday morning we'll be painting. So, yeah. All right, day 10. Let's wrap. See you guys tomorrow, day 11. Tricky D Labs. Ah, it's done. Woohoo, here we are, finally able to get back to work. It's been about four days since we finished building the deck. It's been raining every day, or since we finished sanding the deck, I mean. It's been raining every day, so I haven't had a chance to get out here and get anything else done, but today is paint day. So let's get this thing painted. Uh, it's gotten a little dirty over the last few days with all the rain, so I'm gonna sweep it again, and then uh, we're gonna get out here and get painting. So finally, finally gonna be able to get back to work. Four days of doing nothing was killing me out here, so let's get this shit done. Let's get this shit painted, and then we start actually building the pool. Yeah! Cause I'm on my second pack of switches and my eyes all red. Cause I had a cheap of blood to get my mind on deck. I'm a rolling stone. And there it is. It took about two hours. The entire deck is painted. It looks amazing. If you ever want to know how much coverage you can get out of one gallon of paint, there you go. That was all one gallon of paint. Let's check out the paint we used. We forgot to do that. Show you guys what we used. So this is the Valspar Duramax All Weather 365 Paint and Primer. The color is called Cowboy Boots. So. Valspar Duramax All Weather 365 Paint and Primer Color Cowboy Boots. Looks pretty freaking good. I'm happy with it. I'm going to call that a wrap for today. And then uh, tomorrow we'll start building the pool. So, frick yeah, successful day. Deck painted, Tricky D.